hello all welcome back so in this video we are going to see how we can create a CI/CD pipeline using a cloud build terraform and a google cloud so what we are going to do so we will create a sample terraform file to create a storage bucket and we will create one repository so whenever we are pushing code to our repository the cloud build CI/CD pipeline should trigger and it will execute the terraform init plan and apply and it will create the resources okay so we will see how we can set up this pipeline so let me first walk you through what are the different steps we are going to take for this demo so first we will create a source repository in gcp so just note we are not creating a direct github repository here we will be using a google manage service that is a source code repository in google cloud so we will create a source repository in a gcp then we will clone that repository to our local system in vs code and we'll create some sample terraform configuration file to create a storage bucket then we'll create a cloud build.yaml which will have our pipeline code and it will execute whenever we are pushing code to the repository but how we can configure that so for that we need a cloud build trigger so we have to create a trigger that based on the event of push to the particular branch our uh, CICD pipeline should trigger okay okay now we will go to the google cloud console and let's start with our first step to create a source repository in a gcp so uh, this is my cloud console console from here i will just go to the source repositories i will open this source repository so here uh, these source repositories are nothing but a github repository managed by a google cloud so you can create your repository here or you can directly link your github repository here you could see i directly linked it to the github repository but for this demo i will create locally here in a source repository so here is the option to add repository i will create new repository here you have option to create your github or a bitbucket external repository but i will go with the first option create new repository i will click on continue name i will give CI CI CD with cloud build okay or terraform repo I'll just give TF repo and project I will select okay this one which is my current project and I will create okay once your repository is created this page will open now I want to add code to repository so there are multiple options first push code from local then clone your repository to local git repository so i want to clone this to local and i have google cloud sdk installed so i will use the easiest option that is a google cloud sdk okay and i will simply copy this command and now i want to clone this in this folder so i'll just open terminal here okay and i will type i will just paste that command okay and let me run so it is cloning repo to my d directory okay and it's cloned so let me check if i have tf repo yes i have tf repo here so i directly open my vs code in this folder so either you can open from here open with code or in existing i can just simply type code space dot so it will open a vs code instance in the same folder okay so it opened a vs code instance here okay uh, i have to go to the this repository but i opened in directly in d let me close it so let me go to the tf and then code space dot now it will open in my a repository directory that is tf code tf repo now here i will create a simple terraform file to create storage bucket so i will only create main dot tf and i want to create storage bucket so i will just simply type google terraform provider okay and here i will go to registry 
I will pick the simple code so storage so here is a storage bucket and I will just pick the simplest storage bucket code okay so here I can see very simple code I will copy as it is and I will only add my project name here the project name is missing so it might give error so I will give the project name dev 01 and the bucket name should be unique so already some of the resources has already created with this name so i'll just give tt hyphen cicd build bucket okay so just a unique name i am trying to give and the rest of the things i will keep as it is so this is my terraform code now the next step is we have to create a cloud build yaml file okay so let me create a cloud build yaml also so which will be our pipeline file okay now here i already have a code for this so i'll just uh, copy this code and i will explain what i am trying to do here okay so here the simple command i'm executing in this yaml so here i'm just checking the branch name with this alpine image so whatever the branch name so currently i am having the single branch which is a master by default created then i am checking here i am checking the branch name here i am executing only the terraform init here i am executing the terraform plan and at the end i am checking if uh, my branch name is prod then execute a terraform okay this should be apply so i will execute a terraform apply auto approve okay and if the branch name is not prod it will skip so currently our branch name is master so it won't execute any code here so let me try to push the code now okay so now before we're pushing to the code what we can do we can create cloud build trigger as well so whenever we are pushing code it will create our file to the repository uh, it will trigger our ci cd pipeline so let me open console and go to a cloud build okay so here i will choose us east 4 purposefully because i just already created a lot of pipelines in us central so this time i will choose us east 4 okay and let me go to triggers so i have to create triggers so okay let me select us central one i am not getting create trigger option there okay now let me click on create trigger I will give the TF trigger terraform trigger so tags other things I will keep as it is now what I want whenever code is pushed to branch it should trigger so the repository event I am selecting as a push to branch so this first generation I will keep now repository name so the TF repo which we are using branch it should take any branch okay so if any branch it is pushed it should trigger it and yeah so the cloud bill we want cloud bill configuration file so once i selected this it automatically take the cloud build.yaml file from this tf repo so currently i don't want any approval so i will for now i will keep it blank i won't select that and service account also i want to use the default one because it is having the necessary permission if you are using the custom service account you have to give the proper permission so suppose i am creating the storage bucket using the terraform then you should give permission to create storage bucket to the, your cloud build account so let me create trigger now okay so this is my tf trigger is here event is pushed to branch now let me go to history okay so currently for our repo there is no trigger so our trigger name is tf trigger 
okay so now let me push our code so i will just do git add dot git commit hyphen m initial test i'll just give the name and now git push so immediately i pushed there should be one pipeline trigger one run should trigger okay now let me see here okay and you can see it triggered source is tf repo trigger name is tf trigger let me open it and if see if there are any failures okay so i can see it is successful it executed first the branch name so branch name it is checking the branch name is master then it is executing terraform init which will download all provider plugin then terraform plan so in the plan it is mentioning it will create one storage bucket and the apply so apply is not executing because we have given the condition only if the branch name is prod it should execute now what i will do i will create one more branch with name prod so i will just create git branch let me first show you what are different branches so currently only one branch is here master i will create prod branch okay now let me show you okay so there is one prod branch let me go to the prod branch now okay switch to prod let me again show you now i am in prod branch so git merge master okay so now let me see okay now let me push to the git add git commit Paniyam pushing to prod branch. Okay. Let me add some comment here or something. Git push. Okay, let me copy this. Okay, now it created new branch prod and let's see if our pipeline now triggered new trigger for prod branch. Okay, so now reference is prod. Our code we push to the prod branch and it should execute the terraform apply as well now because we push to the prod branch yeah so it created one storage bucket as well let me see if storage bucket is created let me go to the cloud storage so what was the bucket name so it was ttci cd build hyphen bucket yeah so you can see this bucket is currently created just a uh, some few seconds before now just assume i don't want directly push someone code to the production so before apply i need some approval like i need some code reviewers approval or managers approval so we have that options also so let me go to the trigger and here this is our tf trigger let me edit it Okay, and now I have option here, require approval. Save. Okay, now whenever I am pushing, so let me uh, make some changes or let me create one more bucket now. 
so i will just change the name to bucket 2 and name i will just add 2 okay so let me now push the code okay now let me go and see now this time the pipeline should not trigger automatically and it will wait for approval see the pipeline is not triggered and it is waiting for approval so this sign is for waiting for approval if i open this pipeline so nothing is executed it is waiting for approval now i can check the code if i feel everything is good i can approve else i can reject so I'll just give approving and once I approve then my cloud bill pipeline will trigger for prod so ideally what we can do for a uh, dev pipeline we can do uh, git uh, sorry terraform init and plan and for prod we can set up approval for apply so before approving we can check the plan see if respected resources are getting created and then we can apply okay so now it completed let me check the another bucket is created yeah so this two bucket is also created so in this way we created our ci cd pipeline using cloud build google source code repositories and a terraform so if you have any questions just let me know in so try to answer that okay so thank you for watching this video